Hello gamers, here is how to complete chapter 1 of Lana's quest. So when you spawn in the area, you will see this little clump of white flowers. And these are the flowers we are going to follow to get to Lana's house. Now, while I'm in a server on my own, I do recommend that you go in a server with other people so that you can work together as a team because there's a lot of teamwork in all three of these chapters. And I also recommend you play this event on PC if you can, because then you'll be able to hold shift to dash like I am right now, which you don't need to, but I found it quite helpful. Now, only one person needs to actually get to the house. So if you're playing with someone that knows how to do this, they've done this before, you can just, you know, let them go and find the house technically you actually don't need to do anything in the first chapter <laughs> everything can be done for you by other people but also teamwork is good so <laughs> you know but anyways once you get to lana's house you will find that lana is missing six items which are found by unlocking areas using six keys that are hidden in the house so let's go to the barn first because that has the easiest key to find if we go up this ladder you will find this blue key over here and then we need to go into Lana's, not Lana's bedroom, the guest bedroom. Now I always enter the house through the back rather than the main door because then I can go and look out for the monster that is lurking. Did you guys see it? It is right there waiting for us. So I go and come over here, get it to come here. I go around the kitchen table. And then I go and run upstairs. Even if you can't run, you will make it. I've done this like a lot of times before. And so then we can go and unlock this door using the blue key. We'll get this camera over here. And then we go into Lana's room. You always go into Lana's room to deposit stuff. And there is the camera deposited. Then we go to get the pink key from Lana's bedroom, which we then have to use to unlock the laundry room. Now this may be a little bit tough to get to. I should lure it into the kitchen, then go round to the laundry room. I think that'll be the best strategy. Yeah. So we're gonna go here. Come on, monster. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna go round. Quickly unlock this room. Please let me unlock it in time. And then we go into here and we collect this pallet. Okay, I'm so glad we made it. Then we need to get upstairs. I feel like I'm gonna get caught, but it's fine even if we do, which I did. I just realized I forgot to turn off jump scares. You can turn it off in the settings button at the top. Um, I do recommend that if you don't like horror, um, which I don't. <laughs> I just forgot to turn it off. I always forget. But anyways, we're going to go and do the same little trick again. Or not, because the monster's distracted. Let's just go straight upstairs, go and deposit this in Lana's room. Then next, let's go get the purple key in the guest bedroom, which is right over here. We're going to go and take this to the garage where the teddy bear is. Oh my gosh, no. Oh, for a minute I thought I was stuck there. <laughs> that could have been a massive issue. But anyways, let's go downstairs. Where is the monster? It is lurking around nearby. And let's go up through the kitchen door. And then we go over here and then use the purple key to unlock this door. And once that is unlocked, you can come over here to collect the teddy bear. Then we're gonna go back inside. We have three keys, so there's just three left. I think we should go get the red key next. I mean, the order doesn't really matter, but you know. So if we go out here, we're going to go and exit so that we can enter in through the kitchen. So we can go and collect the red key from here and then go and take it to the basement over here and unlock this door. Now do note, although the monster can sometimes go upstairs, it can't go out of the house. Why is this not unlocking? Did I not pick up the red key? Oh my gosh, I didn't get it. 
Yeah, do you know, the thing will like show up with the unlock button even if you haven't got the key. It just won't unlock. Okay, now I have the key. <laughs> Let's go back to the basement, go and unlock the door, and then go in here, and you will see this little journal over here. Now, the journal is item number five on the list of items for the suitcase, not to be confused with the second item, which is the Greek book. So if you're playing this with other people, do keep that in mind so you know which ones people have already gotten. Let's go. Deposit this over here. And then next, I think we'll go and get the orange. <laughs> oh my gosh, the monster. Oh, I'll just let it get me. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We need to go out anyways. <laughs> the next key is in the kitchen. If we go over here, maybe the monster won't be nearby now. Directly towards me. As if it can sense me. Why Why is it acting like it can sense me? It can't. It can't get me. I think it's just taking a little tour of the house. That's fun. Um, anyways, we need to go over here to pick up the orange key. So we need to go unlock the bathroom door over here. Quickly get in, quickly get in. All right, I'm in. <laughs> And then in the bin, you will get this nail file. Now, let's go out. I'm probably going to get caught, but it's fine. Oh, maybe not. Or maybe not. Oh, my gosh. Why is it not going round? Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. And run, 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 run. All right, here. We got it. We got the nail file. So we just have one last item. Can you unlock using the green key? So the last key is in the living room right by here, but inside by a plant pot. If we go over here, we can go and... Oh my gosh, I didn't collect it. Okay, there we go. We got the key. The last key. Then we can go upstairs over here. Then go up to the attic. And then I think it's behind... Where is it? Oh, here it is. We have the green tails of it. And then we go down there. We go out and into Lana's room and deposit this last item. And that is chapter one complete. You will then be teleported to chapter two, but you can also just leave the game as soon as part two loads in. And then you can go and join another server so that you're with more people in case there's not a lot of people in your server that you're doing chapter one in. But anyways, I hope this was helpful for you all. Good luck with doing chapter one of this quest. Let me know if you've done all of the quests. But anyways, that is the end of the video. Make sure you ring the bell to be notified. You'd like and subscribe. And thank fortune and hope you enjoy. Make sure you subscribe for notifications on so you never miss another upload.